Hey guys, Alessand, welcome to a brand new player review today. And this guy is Aramenko. Uh, last uh, player review I did was Palacio, and that went down really well. They got my like, highest, most views in my uh, FIFA 16 today at the moment. So, I decided to do a new one, and I'm probably going to carry on with these, because these go very, very well on my channel. And this guy is Aramenko. You probably heard of him. Um, he wasn't really heard until this year, because he's an ace 2 rated and he's a shiny player. And uh, some of his stats are really good in game, but he's very cheap for the player. I'll go on to the actual cons first because there's not many cons, uh, but they're quite easy to explain. First of all, it's slow. He's very slow, and it's so sort of sluggish. I wouldn't say it's actually. He was probably less slow, but feels more sluggish than he should be. He's got like 70 something pace, but he feels like quite slow and he just feels like defenders can actually catch up with him very easily secondly we got is his nation and his nation and his league i don't like the russian league at all because i think every time you play with it um it just lets you down the players in there in there are good hulk uh Witzel, all of them are getting good in there but if for some reason it never performs especially akavi was the shittest player ever uh shittest goalkeeper ever played and also his nation, he's, fi he's Finnish, I think he is. So, um, whoever wants to play with a Finnish team, you can. So, we'll go on to the pros now. First of all, he's a very cheap card, as I said earlier. Secondly, he's got four-star skill, which is brilliant. The Berber top spin, as I keep saying this on so many videos, it's so good in this game. Very effective. Uh, and his next stat is is definitely the best thing about him. And that's definitely his long shot. Some of the goals you'll see are absolute belters. They're so good. Like, I think I scored one from like 40 yards out, so far out, and it went top bins, it was so good. If you haven't used his long shots, he's very good for like compilation goals. So if you're trying to get some like uh, montages on, definitely use this guy for skills and also long shots. It's so good. Also, his finishing in the box as well is very good. I mean, he scored, I think he's my top goal scorer in my team, and the team you saw, if you if you didn't see it, he's got Dumbia, Musa in form. And he's got a top. He's a top goal scorer. Especially most of his goals are from outside the box. But there is like a couple that he got inside the box, both left and right foot. He scored, which is very good. And finally, his pace is um, his passing. I mean, his passing is very good. I mean, the best part about his passing is definitely for like the over, like the over top balls or the balls to cross the pitch. Which are very good in this game. Especially with him. They always get to the right player when you need him. And especially when their defence has gone to one side. And lob it over to the other side. Where they've got so much space is the best thing about it. So overall I'll definitely rate him. Uh, probably an 8. Because this slow, his slowness let me down. Which was really annoying. If he, has, if he had a bit more pace. It would be so good. And also if his uh, nation was probably like. Let's say France. But it probably it will never be. But if it was, that would be so much better because you can link up with better players. So I hope you enjoyed this review. Also, make sure to leave a subscribe because there's going to be COD videos in the future and they're very derpy. So I hope you enjoyed. Please like, subscribe and peace.